Hi right there guys, here we are now. We've come up to the barn, or well, I've come up to the barn, Extreme Pro Koi, uh, to pick up a, a heat pump. Um, I've got the big, uh, the big one, which is a seven, the seven one, but this is a small one that I've been hearing a lot about. So I've come up to see Keith today. He's gonna show me it, and I'll be putting this on me growing on system for when I do the, the uh, competition with the, you guys, you members. So we should have a chat with Keith now about what this pump can do. Um, but as I say, I've heard really good things about it. So what have we got here, Keith? Hello, Joe. Okay, so this is the um, nano reversible heat pump. This yep. is the um, three kilowatt output model. And, um, very, very efficient, um, all based on ambient air temperature. So daylight to day, it'll be worked absolutely beautifully. Yeah. Um, input wattage is only 600 watts, so incredibly cheap to run with a maximum output wattage of uh, three kilowatts so uh, yeah. uh, once you've got air temperature sort of eight degrees and above you're going to be able to keep your pond up to a sort of two and a half thousand gallons at whatever temperature you want for, for 600 watts so uh, yeah very very affordable and a uh, very affordable unit to buy priced at 495 so, and the bits on the front you got bits the on the front in so, and out yes it says in out comes with two host towels so very very simple if you want flexible. Yeah. Um, this is a I'll do that. one inch male thread. So um, okay. we have uh, fittings in the shop, one inch female pressure fittings which will go on there, and right, then from that good. we can adapt you onto any size pipe work you require. Then you've got your display. Is that LED and all? That's a lit digital display. I'll, tie it. There, I'll, tie it. I'll let you do that when you get home, Joe. Okay, yeah. So we've got, got all the display side of it. Oh, there you go, look. Okay. So that basically from here, you can up, down for you, adjusting your temperatures, set to the different parameters. Um, one of the things with this unit, which is quite good, hence the name Nano Reversible, is it not only heats, um, heating is from 15 degrees as a minimum heating temperature upwards. Right, yeah. It would also allow you to chill the water. Um, so you have to chill it down to I believe it's eight degrees on this one. That's what I want, um, yeah. So yeah. if people are quarantining fish and they want the chilling ability, uh, this unit will give it give it to them as long as obviously the size of the unit is spec. I can't believe I can't believe how small it is. It's I mean, tiny, yeah, but really tiny. We've been running them in the quarantine room. We've been running them since. Uh, where did we put them on there? November, December. Um, struggled over the winter. Yeah, honest, yeah. Because um, the air temperature even in here got too cold. But but now we're, we've got ponds running, which have been running yeah. at 24 degrees for, for months now, uh, for very little electricity. Well, um, at, the see, at the moment, I've got, um, on my one, I've got an electro, which yeah. I've, I've, I've fitted up. But um, when I looked at my electric, my electric was on 7, 7, thousand, was it? No, yeah, 7, Seven kilowatts. Yeah, so this is six hundred. Which is a lot of money to be paying out. There's nothing. So that there is what six hundred watts. Six hundred watts for the maximum output of three kilowatt. Obviously, the output is governed by the input air temperature. So the colder yeah, yeah, it yeah. gets, the less output you'll get. But typically, at above eight to ten degrees air temperature, that six kilowatt coefficient on the six on the six hundred watts will give you the full three kilowatts. And moving forward, um, we've got coming, um, exclusive to us later on in the year, four kilowatt and five kilowatt models, which will have a much lower heating temperature. Set. They're just slightly bigger, aren't they? Or? A little bit bigger, yeah. I can't, I've got them running here, we're yeah. testing them, but I can't, I can't show no, you. No, that's good. That is good. No, that is good. But as I say, that the, when you look at the prices of these, um, they're sort of, they are well affordable. Um, when I looked at my um, three kilowatt Electra, I think I paid. Well, like 270 or 300 quid on it? 300 if it's an analogue, so it's a tip one. Um, I wouldn't say mum was cheap. Well, second hand, mate. <laughs> they're a lot more than that for with these But that, I mean, what do these work out to roughly? 495. See, 495, so you get 495, it's you're using less wattage, which is a lot better um, for the hobbyists. Um, it's, it's a no brainer, really. I mean, if, you've got, if you have got an electro, maybe move the electro on and then look at buying. The nano, um, and then you might say, "Well, why do that?" But I would then say, "Well, why did I go from like sixteen hundred um, or one thousand six hundred pumps to be flow friend?" Well, the reason being is it might have cost say fifteen, sixteen, eight hundred quid, but then when I had it on, I was doing like a hundred watts, like running far more water, so it pays for itself in the long run. So the nano, the nano reversible. 
will pay for itself in the long run. The only sort of to, sorry to put yeah, no caveat with that is obviously if you're looking to say keep an outdoor pond at 15 degrees in the middle of winter, yeah. this won't do it. That's right, yeah. Because the air temperature of the air is pulling in, you'll eventually get to the point where it's actually taking in 600 watts to give you back 600 yeah, watts, yeah, yeah. so it won't so actually it's not, heat. Yeah. So it's more of a seasonal heating device yeah, 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 or yeah. for an indoor smaller pond up to say sort of 800 gallons yeah um so hence why we're looking at the four or five kilo models which again we yeah. should have place on the year um if you're interested i've only got one left in stock so it's joe's over this one that's joe's buying two no um, i could afford um, to buy two at that price um <laughs> uh, but there are more coming however due to this crazy where we're in at the moment that price is subject to change of shipping, changing all the time and what have you. But uh, at the moment, they're 495 if anybody wants to take the last one off of me. That's it. And the thing, if you give Keith a ring on 01689 878 161, or he's got his Twitter at Coy Water Barn and Facebook at Coy Water Barn. Um, but as I say, I'll, I'll be doing some updates on it. But from what I've heard, it is well worth um, getting one. So I'm happy if you guys are happy. So it's a good buy from me and a good buy from Keith. Also, socially distance as well. <laughs>